Hey guys, I'm showing off my rig. Yes, I know about not having your PC on carpet. So what? So bother why? So I retrofit my modern PC. Modern PC into a classic shell. I did not put the uh, I didn't put the side fans the side panels in yet because if I did it's gonna be um it's gonna destroy it. it's gonna um overheat my system. So I left it open. Just let it open. I don't really care anyways, just leave it open. So yeah, so you could tell I kind of retrofit a USB 2.0 into years into this and hopefully I get a new case. I have a old gateway case. I took the whole system out and then just gonna wait for a little bit to find a MTX and retrofit it. I like retrofitting um, modern cases into older uh, cases. So you could tell there's two fans right there and you have that graphics card. I like the graphics card because it's so uh, convenient. What's a GTX 1050 Ti, 4GB, that's all. Nothing major, just something I need for gaming, but not like extremely gaming, like um, ray tracing. I don't really want ray tracing right now. I was going to think about waiting. And then, of course, when... Oh, I don't want to get any political one since state told oh we don't need to make any more semiconductors right now you need to behave and stay at home so these people listened and now these semiconductor shortage is affecting everybody it's affecting computers affecting medical equipment it's affecting automobility uh, automobile uh, let me phrase it um, automobile and it's almost affecting today's life now it's like almost putting back to stone age really close so, this PC is a uh, Ryzen 5 2600, that's it, not X, or G, whatever they have that nowadays. Um, it's, uh, it's, um, uh, the RAMs are really cheap, it's like 21, uh, 33, uh, megahertz, uh, 2 by, two by 8 gigabytes, I don't, they like, um, what is it? See, I know my cable management sucks, but just deal with me. See, you're supposed to put them in dull channel, and that runs better than having a one ch channel. This motherboard was a replacement to my other one. The only thing that stinks is they never came up, came with M.2 screws. So I don't, I'm out, uh, and then I don't know what to do. Other than that, um. The power supply is the EGVA uh, 55 or 50 watt, uh, 50 500 watt uh, power supply. It's just good enough. And my, here, here's my other storage. That's 500 gig. That's not my main. My main is like right down here. Probably won't see it. That's my main, um, Drive the power to boot up the system. I game on it once in a while. I stopped playing on it because I have so much work. I finally able to get home really quick. I finally put a Wi-Fi on there. I wish I got this, the Tough Gaming X570 Plus Wi-Fi edition, and pay a little bit more for the Wi-Fi. But oh well, I'm happy what I have. Um, this is my my DVD player. Or burn or whatever you call it. I got it for four bucks at a I don't know what it is, the half grocery store and the half not. They can do they they're doing something that's cool. I like it when the things are ROS compliant because it's more environmentally friendly, but I like it because I don't have to wash my hands like oh it's because I touch lead, I need to go immediately go wash my hands after I did some touch something. This is just a USB, uh, yeah, like I it says external um, ODD and HDD device. Something tells me if I open this, it probably has a interfacing to the CD drive. And CD drive is, they probably build this. I might be, I might be seeing, I can see what's inside of this.
Alrighty. Please like and subscribe to this video if you ever want, want more information. Bye.